Hey guys, Ronin Sensei, Doomsday Preppers Forums. Um, kind of bet you some of you are wondering why I recommend some of the things I do. Not all of you, but some of you. Uh, part of the reason is, is because unlike a lot of you, I have an opportunity to use it either in combat, which, uh, you know, I'm an overseas contractor, and, uh, you know, security expert. Also, I live on a farm. I have 20 acres out in uh, Southern California hills here. And uh, due to the storm, I have opportunities like this where I have a tree come down and it starts blocking the roadway, so I have to start cutting it up. Um, most people would probably go for a chainsaw in this circumstance, but, uh, you know, I like to use some of the tools I have. This is why I, uh, I recommend <clears throat> machetes like this. Uh, this is the Cold Steel Jungle Machete. You're looking at, I mean, at worst, 30 bucks. I think, uh, I think at best, about 20. Um, if you look at it, it's a very head-heavy design, which is what's nice, is that I can carry a machete that also functions similar to a hatchet. Uh, it does similar work, similar jobs to a hatchet, uh, but at the same time is small enough and nimble enough to be used as a machete if you'd like to use it as a machete. So it gives you all of those cutting options while at the same time staying functional. Also, you'll notice the thickness of this is a lot thicker than what most people are used to or accustomed to with machetes. It's on the borderline of short sword uh, with its thickness because you'll see there's not a lot of flex in it. There's some, but not a lot. Um, since it's uh, 1055 carbon, it's got just enough flex in it though, so it's not going to break on you very easy either. So uh, I'm going to go to work on this. This branch here is probably about four or five inches round, so uh, we'll see uh, if this makes quick work of it or not. stuff out of my way. Well, there you go. Made relatively quick work of it. So, as you can see, I'm not too winded, not too burnt out. It may seem like a lot of work. Really, it does most of the work for me. No hot spots on my hand that didn't feel bad at all. So, Cold Steel Jungle Machete makes a uh, thick branch work even uh, relatively easy. So as you can see, it does its work, does it well. It doesn't come with this, I made this, but uh, in the end, it's very handy to have, especially when walking around the farm, even for rattlesnakes, things like that. So uh, this will gear up real easy. You can tie it onto your gear anywhere. Uh, it's fairly lightweight. I, I don't really notice it. It doesn't really cut into me much. So. Anyways, uh, I hope this was informative. I hope that uh, you guys can uh, make an informed decision now. And uh, once again, Ronin Sensei for Doomsday Preppers Forums. Hope you guys like it.